Good morning, YouTube. Happy Saturday. This is Adam back here. I want to show you some of my graded modern baseball cards. I have six of them to show you, so let us get started. Hope you enjoy. The first one I want to show you is this gorgeous 1984 Fleer Update first card of Roger Clemens. Hopefully he'll make the Hall of Fame sometime, but I know he got caught for steroids and basically lied to Congress, so we'll see what happens with that, but over a 300 pitch, I'm sorry, 300 win pitcher with over 4,000 strikeouts, it's a pretty fantastic career, played for multiple teams, and born in Dayton, Ohio, which is an interesting fact, so that's very cool. The next one is a Hall of Famer. We have here a 1984 Fleer Update card of Kirby Puckett. Graded a near mint to mint 8. A gorgeous card. He had a very, very good career, all with the Minnesota Twins. I believe he had a 318 career batting average. And he actually had a lot of power, too. I think he hit over 200 home runs, if I remembered right. But... That's his first card right there. And the final Fleer 84 update card I want to show you is this former Indians pitcher Dwight Doc Gooden. Uh, graded a near mint 7. He had a very, very good pitching career. And I believe he is the uncle of Gary Sheffield, who should be a Hall of Famer. He had over 500, 500 career home runs. So... The next card I have right here is this gorgeous 19, 1982 Topps Traded Cal Ripken Jr. card. It's technically not his rookie card, but it's his, you know, his first uh, card by himself. You know, graded an 8.5. His rookie card actually has multiplayers on it from the original 82 top set. This is a very expensive card, especially in very, very high grade. So... That's it right there. This next one is this very popular Don Mattingly 84 Donruss card. A very, very gorgeous set. I think Don Mattingly should be in the Hall of Fame. I know he had a shortened career because of back injuries and such, but he had over a 300 career batting average. Hit for power. I don't believe he won any World Series. So that's probably what's keeping him out of the Hall of Fame. But that's a very popular card of him. And the last card I want to show you is no other than Sammy Sosa. Donruss, baseball's best, graded a X-Mint 6. His only card as a Texas Ranger. And, uh... Yeah, he had a very good career, even though despite some of the situations with steroids and stuff like that. But remember in, in uh, 1998 when him and McGuire were going after the home run chase, that was pretty cool. So um, here is this card right here. Well, everybody, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe, and I'll talk to you all later. Thank you again.